With Curator, you don't have to lose visibility into the applications that exist on the cloud. Let me show you another example. In this case, uh, with Office 365. And all I had to do to get this to work was basically going and define a DSM, which we have one out of the box. I selected it, and then these three parameters were given to me for the account uh, to be set up. Uh, and I selected to, to get logs from all these uh, Office 365 application. I saved it, deployed the changes, and that was it. So let's get some logs going. So actually I'm going to log in into uh, this account that I have and I'm going to execute a few things uh, expecting to get some logs into uh, Curator from the things that I will be doing in Office 365 in the cloud. So I'm here in Office uh, 365 and let me go to say mail and uh, let's say that I'm going to be deleting uh, couple of emails here and uh, oh, I don't want to do that so I want to delete uh, some uh, pieces of email here and uh, hopefully that uh, alone will generate uh, some logs and these things the, the thing that you need to know is that these things may take a while the polling intervals in which you get the the logs are not as as fast as when you have it on your own network but they are uh, you know close enough to be still relevant, to be correlated with all the actions that the person are, are, uh, is doing within your corporate network. So after a few minutes or two, let's go here and I have a search Look for the last five minutes where the log source is uh, Office 365, as you see here as a filter, and I do get, you know, the events that I uh, deleted a couple of uh, files. In fact, we can actually dive into it and see you know the source IP destination IP notice that this is not something happening uh, within the, my network this happened all in the cloud and we get the details of the yeah, that I deleted uh, some files from the from the folder info again you don't lose visibility when your applications are in the cloud because those logs get sent uh, to curator and the configuration is uh, pretty easy